Wrapped in a warm red sweater, baby Francis looked like the perfect Christmas gift for parents Michael and Caitlin, and that's exactly what he was supposed to be. He was. He was supposed to be born on the 23rd, so we told our children that Santa was bringing him, and that was a lie. So, <laughs> <laughs> so he had his own agenda. Francis kept his older brothers William and Henry waiting a little over a week longer instead, a perfect way to start 2017 for this family from Marlowe. I was actually really surprised because he was born after 5 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> so, I mean, I, it was cool. and He had to have his dramatic moments. Mom Caitlin is predicting that little Francis will probably always have his own agenda. She thinks he wanted to avoid the drama of 2016 and have his own moment. I just hope that he grows up happy and this is a new year. We can leave all that 2016 stuff behind and he decided that he didn't want to be a part of that and he's <laughs> starting off the year fresh. She and Father Michael are just happy. Their son, born at 8 pounds, 13 ounces and 21 inches long, is healthy. I thought he looked perfect. Uh, I just hope he can keep up with his brothers. <laughs> He's so cute. In the meantime, a family at Dartmouth Hitchcock Hospital gets the honor of having New Hampshire's first baby of the new year. The new arrival, Vane Michael Stanwood, was born at about 12.03 this morning. He's just two pounds, four ounces, but parents say he's happy and healthy.